What's up everyone and welcome back to You Can Be Player 2. Today we are going to continue with the Injustice 2 story mode. Oh, man, I'm excited. I, I am digging this so far. Of course, we are only on Chapter 2, but I'm loving this game so far. But yes, we are going to jump right back into the story mode. If you haven't seen Episode 1 of the story mode, Go back and check that out so you're not totally lost. This is a chronological kind of... Well, I guess not because the first chapter was a flashback, but... I mean, this is this is a series. You gotta watch... The story goes in order. You gotta watch them in order. Well, you don't have to. It's up to you. Totally up to you. But if you haven't seen episode one, which was chapter one of story mode, you can go back and do so on the channel. I'm also going to be building a playlist as we go along. So if you just want to get on that playlist, watch them all in order, you can do that as well. But for those of you who did watch Chapter 1, if you haven't and you don't want anything to be spoiled, plug your ears for about 30 seconds. So if you watched Chapter 1, here's just a little recap. Just, you know, because it's been a few days. So just a little, oh jeez, I went back to the menu. So here's just a little re recap, refresher, reminder of what happened in Chapter 1. Chapter 1 was Batman, and of course we saw him going to, it was a flashback. We saw him going to Arkham Asylum to try and stop Superman who's trying to bring his own form of justice to the criminals in Arkham Asylum. And we instead saw Robin turn on Batman and leave with Superman. I'm digging the hell out of Robin still. I love I love this kind of evil sort of tendencies coming from Robin. I love it. So we're going to jump right back into story mode, continue with chapter 2. We're going to go to see if Give me one. Let's see. If we hit continue, we should be able to pick up right where we left off. I never meant to. We did. You coward. We are at war with these animals. You so yeah, this is exactly what I was just you talking about. Robin taking off with or Jason or Superman. Anyone. I forgot his name for a second. Damn. That's enough. Let's go. And again, we already saw this part, so I'm not too worried about talking over it. But again, I'm going to try not to talk too much over the cutscenes. Because, I mean, I want to follow along and see what's going on. And of course, I don't want to talk over it, so you can follow along as well. But just in case I do, I am talking. Oh, he's still dead. Damn. Um, <laughs> in case I am talking, I did leave the subtitles on. So, we'll go with that as well. Here we go. It's been years since the regime fell. Superman's behind bars. Damien, my own son, is there with him. Oh, shit. But we can't ever forget why we put them there. We must stay vigilant. I thought your goal was to reassure people, Mr. Wayne. You're not alone in rebuilding Oh, shit. That, yeah, okay. But if we don't change some minds soon... thought that's why you hired that overpaid PR firm, Lucius. Didn't realize that was and Bruce Wayne. Folks to move back to these cities and I guess I could have figured that when he said my son Damien, but whatever. Superman's never getting out. I made that clear. But Wonder Woman, Black Adam, Aquaman, they're still out there somewhere. And seemingly immune to prosecution. I know you built Brother Eye to keep tabs on all those loose ends, but the public doesn't know. Brother Eye's secrecy is critical. Our enemies can't fight something they don't know exists. Well, then at least follow one bit of advice we paid those PR people so much money for. What's that? Be a little less Batman, a little more billionaire playboy. Get out around town in the daylight. And smile. Focus groups show people feel safer when they see you smile. Hmm. That would be your other job. Bruce, consider widening your circle of trust. Nobody wins all by themselves. Not even you. As a reception area, this place needs a lot of work. Dinah, Oliver, thanks for coming on short notice. You're lucky we found a sitter. Damn, that's cool. I want one of those in my house. Just a secret wall with one button you press and then an the elevator goes God knows where. I want one. Who do I call? Does anybody know a good contractor? My great-grandfather built the original Gotham Underground. But these days... 
It's the Bat Cave. And this is Brother Eye. More like the Eye of Sauron. Surveillance hub? More than that. A communications hub. Linking every satellite and server on the planet. It warns us when trouble's coming. And guides us when trouble's here. Must take a real genius to operate. I don't know about genius. But I do got a PhD. Well, hello. A world away, but the change of scenery is nice. I was surprised you called, Bruce. Things seem to be going well. So, what's up? Dismantling the regime created gaps in global security. We're covering them where we can, but we're stretched thin, vulnerable. Harleen, show them what you found. Right, old bats. Gorilla Grodd. Everyone's favorite talking ape. He's got himself a band of bozos. Calls them the society. My mole in Gorilla Fun City name. says Grodd's planning something big. But what, where, when, we don't know. One thing we do know, Scarecrow's gonna ship Grodd a buttload of fear gas from a hideout in Slaughter Swamp. Very mosquito -y. Good thing I packed my bug spray. I need you three to stop that gas before it gets to Grodd. Not joining us for the party? Unfortunately, I can't leave Gotham without worrying the public. Don't worry, Bats. With this crew on the job, what could go wrong? Mm, Lord, I imagine many, many guys, things can go wrong. you really trust Harley? Right. She's a different person since Joker died. Mostly. As she grabs a knife, of course. Oh, this is Harley's chapter. Okay. All right. The girl who laughs, huh? Let's see what's going on. Oh, they spy sneaky, sneaky. Shh, shh. It ain't move any faster. I don't need Grodd taking my head off because your boys are too slow. Fear not, Deadshot. We'll be ready for tomorrow's attack. Tomorrow? Cheeky monkey. Uh oh. Fancy meeting you here. Keep them moving. I'll see what that's about. Red, I ain't seen you in forever. You here to take down these punks? Ooh, there's my boy. Quite the catch, Ivy. Red? You're with them? Your man, Bruce, was supposed to better care for the green. All he's done is remodel the concrete jungles of Gotham and Metropolis. Where I sit, there's not much difference between him and Superman. Uh, you're a few cones short of a pine if you think your new friends care about the green. Grodd will keep his promises, or he'll be my next victim. Oh, Red, why are you making me do this? Oh, oh, look at her. She's a badass. Let me get you out of here, girl. We can team up again. Drive all the boys crazy, you know, like the old days. Damn. The old days were fun, but these days I'm all business. Damn. Oh, shit. All right, let's go. Hit with a hammer. Come on. Oh, shit. All right, so here we go. Ch oh, damn. Shit. Damn, I'm doing pretty good. I was just about to say I haven't played as Harley yet, but damn, we're doing good. Dang. We whooping a bitch ass. Jeez almighty. Look at this. This is a nice stage, though. I like this stage. <laughs> so let's see here. I'm gonna try and do I have her super move yet? I don't. Ah, ah! Ooh, what is that little thing? There we go. Let's see where. Oh, she's. Oh no no no. no. Oh. Oh God. Oh Lord. Oh God. I don't like that thing. 
That thing is ugly. Jesus. Damn, that took like half my health bar. Lord. Oh, look, a dog. Look, two dogs. Oh, look at that. Let's see what hurts. Let's see. Hit it, hit it. Uh oh. Ooh, ow, ooh. Oh god. I ran the boob. I. Lord have mercy. Dog bit right in the titty. You see that? Damn. That was vicious. I mean, she didn't really do much. The dogs kind of did everything, but still. That was rough. Ooh, uppercut. We got her. Pistol whip. Oh, jeez. Damn, these two had something going on. Ooh, the gas. Oh. Ooh. Oh, hell no. Sh I used to have this stuff for kicks. Then you'll appreciate my new formula. Oh, he's, he's so creepy. I love him. Oh, look at him. He's so cool. Mm, you have a high tolerance. But everyone has something to fear. Oh, I don't want to do it. I don't want to kick you. I don't want to kick you, Scarecrow, but I have to. There we go. I can I can never hit that Oh, there's a damn alligator over here. Come on. I mean, I don't want to do I don't want to do it, Scarecrow. I really don't. I love you. I don't want to do it, but I have to whoop your ass. For the sake of the story, I got to whoop your ass. Boom, there we go. Oh. Come on, dogs. Help me out here. There we go. Hey, that was a nice little combo. Damn. You know what? For not being, for not playing this hurt before, I'm doing pretty well. She's so sassy. I love it. Let's see here. And oh, damn it. Come on, come on. Get him. Boom. Ooh, those damn dogs. I like how they have the mohawks. Is that Cosmo and Wanda? Look, we got a pink one and a green one. That's Cosmo and Wanda right there. Dang. Fairly odd parents. They're still around. There we go. Get them, Wanda. That's it. I, you know what? I've named these dogs now. That's it. We can never go back. Ooh, there we go. Got it, finally. Cosmo and Wanda. What do you know? Hey, right, Wanda. Come on, finish him, finish him. We're close, we're close. There we go. No, 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 there we go. Ooh, we got a cube. That means costumes, possibly. Uh-oh, you better run, uh-oh. Ooh, she gonna get kidnapped, I already know. She gonna get abducted. Did she? Nope, yep, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, she did. This is definitely not. Oh, she's probably in a nightmare. Oh, you already know who this is. You already know. Ugh. Oh. Ugh. Oh. Always such a 
disappointment. Why do I bother? Ain't no slick fella with a cheap suit and cheap a grin telling me who I am ever again. We had mad love once upon a time. But now that's over, Mr. J. Oh, I love that scene. Oh, he gonna whip my ass. Look at this stage, though. This stage is pretty, too. Like, they have some really good designs. Let's see. I'm gonna get my ass kicked, though. This will be the fight I lose. This will be the one. There we go. Come on. Come on, Cosmo. Or Wanda, whoever. Damn, Cosmo ain't done shit. There we go. There's there's Cosmo. Come on. I need to learn. Oh, my gosh. Again, I'm stuck in a position where I don't know these people's moves. I mean, Harleys are... Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh no. Well, I, I lost. Oh god, oh lord. Dang. Oh my god, jeez. Overkill much? Lord have mercy. Alright, here we go. We, got, we can't mess around. I do not want to lose a fight this chapter. I really don't. There we go. Boom! Flawless. Look at that. There you go. Come on, Harley. Go, Cosmo. Or Wanda. <laughs> okay, now go, Cosmo. Nope. Okay, here we go. Let's try this instead. I love this costume on Harley, too. It's so retro. I love it. There you go. Cosmo. Oh, Negan. He got Negan. Did you see that? Baseball bat right to the head. There we go. See, I am not messing around today. I am not. Let's get it. Nope. Oh. <laughs> I love it. I love these little clash interactions. Oh god. Okay, find something. Throw something at him. Do something. Nope. Come on. Come on. Uppercut. Sweep the leg. There we go. Bam! Got him. Whew. I love all the references she makes, or the references I force out of her. I'm pretty sure that's not a reference to Cosmo and Wanda, but it is in my book. Yeah, you better get out of there before you start tripping again. Oof. Oof. Look at all that spandex we got going on right there. Did you see that? What is this? Is that Groot? No, I'm just kidding. I know it's not Groot. Uh-oh. Swampy, that's me! Oh, Lord. Swampy. That's me. I'm Swampy. It's a little inside joke. Some of my friends, they call me Swampy. And by some, I mean one in particular. Call me Swampy. There's a story behind it. Maybe when I'm not trying to focus, I'll tell you. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. I mean, I'm doing pretty well, so I guess I could tell you. I, um, just walking around campus at my college or the university I went to, they, they always had the sprinklers on. No matter what was, no matter what the weather, their sprinklers were always on, so it made the grass, well, for lack of a better term, really swampy, and there was just mud everywhere, and the grass was real soggy all the time, and it it got kind of old, like I'm not gonna lie. So, you know, I was walking to class. Oh, what did I throw? On? We were walking to class one day, and I ran into a friend of mine, and she was like, "Hey, how you doing? You know, how's your day going?" And I was something like that. She's like, hey, like along those lines, like, "How you doing?" Or, Something like that. And I was like, eh, you know, swampy. Just thought it... Yeah, just... <laughs> that, that was literally the only thing I said. I was like, swampy. Because I just walked through the grass. And I was sick of getting my damn shoes dirty all the time. And sick of it. So I was just... Swampy. You know, and it just kind of stuck. So from then on, she called me swampy. So I just whooped his ass. Boom! Megan. There we go. Look, we got all that shit. 
Black Thunder. Yeah. I see. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh god. Oh god. Run, Scarecrow. If they return, I will be ready. Yeah, you tell them not, Groot. Consider that should our interests align. For now, go. This swamp must heal. And now he's shrinking. Damn, well, alright. I do believe that is the end of the Harley Quinn chapter. In fact, I know it was because that was four fights and you can see we're already transitioning to someone else. So I'm going to cut to the main menu so we can see what we got today. Alright, here we go. Story, chapter two, rewards. Let's see what we got. We got the Circus Freak Firearms. Ooh, so we got some new pistols for Harley. Now, something that I that I didn't know last time that I do know now. Do you see next to the gun it says 20 in gold? We cannot equip these pieces of gear until our character reaches that level. So unfortunately, we cannot use this yet on Harley because I highly doubt she's level 20. After the first chapter with Batman, he ended around level 4, so we still got some work to do with each character, but we got that. So let's see, if it's like last time we should have got a shader, yep. Waller's Jester, again a common shader, but that's okay. I love colors, as you saw from the Skullgirls episode, I love colors. So there we go. That's what we got today. Thank you once again for joining me for the Injustice 2 story mode. Please be sure to like and subscribe, of course, if you like this video, hit that thumbs up button. Stay tuned, we still got a lot of story to go. Ah, but that was chapter 2, so thoughts, I gave my thoughts in chapter 1, so here we go, thoughts, chapter 2. That was kind of quick. I feel like that one was a lot quicker than chapter 1, but I like that we got to play as Harley. That was fun, we saw the Joker, we saw Scarecrow, good, good. We saw Scarecrow, I'm good. But that scene with the Joker, that shit was hot. You know it was, you know it was a nightmare from the gas. See, this is why I like Scarecrow. That gas makes you trip, man. Scares the shit out of you. Nightmare gas, I am not trying to mess with that. No thanks. But we saw the Joker. He's in the story. Of course, he's, he's dead. So of course it had to be in something like that. But I'm just glad we saw him. I love the interactions between him and Harley in these games. Just gorgeous. So yeah, that was chapter two. I'm gonna guess Supergirl is probably chapter three from what we saw. Maybe I'll do some do some work with her. Probably not. You know what? I didn't play with Harley before and we did pretty good. We did not lose a battle this time. We did not lose a fight, so that's good. But yeah, so we'll we we kicked ass. We kicked ass. Yes! We kicked ass. So anyway, thank you once again for joining me today. My name is Bukaya. Bring your controller next time, and you can be player two. Harley Quinn wins.